we're going to go over two examples of finding the characteristic equation of a 3x3 three three matrix. The characteristic equation comes from this fact, that lambda being an eigenvalue of a matrix A is equivalent to this coefficient matrix having a zero determinant. So we take the determinant, set that equal to zero, and that's the characteristic equation. Once we go through the calculations, the equation looks like this. There's a link in the description to my lesson introducing eigenvalues and eigenvectors if you need to review some of this stuff. But here in our first example, we're asked to find the characteristic equation of this given matrix. And to do that, we're going to have to find the determinant of lambda times the identity minus the given matrix A and then set that equal to zero. Lambda times the identity minus A just looks like this. All of the entries of A are negated, so negative one becomes positive one, negative five becomes positive five, and so on. And then the entries on the main diagonal have a lambda added to them. And then of course, we're taking the determinant, so we've got those straight bars. Now, to take the determinant of this 3x3 three three matrix, it's probably easiest to use the diagonal trick. So, we rewrite the first two columns to the right of this matrix, and then we can use diagonals to calculate the determinant. I'll leave a link in the description to my lesson going over this trick if you need to review. From here, it's just a whole bunch of algebra. The first thing we do is multiply along these rightward diagonals and add those products together. So we can see all the lambda terms multiplied together here. And then one times negative one times five gives us that negative five. And then one times negative one times negative one gives us the plus one. Then we have to do the same thing with the leftward diagonals, but we are going to subtract their sum. The first leftward diagonal is lambda minus 4 times 5, which we see there. The next diagonal ends up just being lambda minus 1. And then we have 1 times negative 1 times lambda plus 1, so that's minus lambda plus 1. So all of this is being subtracted. So that's our determinant. Now we just have to expand and simplify. Lambda minus 4 times lambda plus 1 gives us this quadratic. Negative 5 plus 1 is negative 4. And then we do some expanding and combining like terms over here. 5 lambda plus lambda minus lambda is just 5 lambda. And then, of course, we have minus 20 and minus 2. Multiplying lambda minus 1 times this quadratic gives us this cubic, which we will simplify. And then we still have the minus 4, and then minus 5 lambda, and plus 20, and plus 2, distributing that negative through those brackets. Finally, combining like terms, we arrive at this, what we would call the characteristic polynomial. This is the determinant of the matrix. So to find the characteristic equation, we just set this equal to zero. And that is our characteristic equation. It's the determinant of lambda i minus a set equal to zero. The solutions to this characteristic equation are the eigenvalues of the original matrix. Here's one more example. We'll go through this one a little more quickly. This is the given matrix, and we begin by writing lambda i minus a, which just consists of all the entries of a being negated. So instead of 5, we have negative 5. Instead of 2, we have negative 2, and so on. But then also add lambdas on the main diagonal. This is in straight bars because we're taking the determinant and we'll set that equal to zero. We take the determinant as before with the diagonal trick. The rightward diagonals are added together and then we subtract the products along the leftward diagonals seen there. Once we do all of the algebra, we end up here. This is our simplified characteristic polynomial and then we'll set this equal to zero. And so that is the characteristic equation of this matrix. Matrix. The solutions to this equation are the eigenvalues of the matrix. And that's how to find the characteristic equation of a 3x3 three three matrix. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions, and I'll leave a link in the description to a lesson where we go over actually finding the eigenvalues of a 3x3 three three matrix. Also, be sure to check out my Linear Algebra course and Linear Algebra Exercises playlists in the description for more. Thanks for watching. Stressed out, sweetie, I'm stressed out. Sounds like you've been stressed out. Tell
me what you're stressed about. <laughs> stressed out, honey, I've been stressed out lately. Don't know what's what, don't know what I'm stressed about. Stressed out, sweetie, I'm stressed out. Sounds like you've been stressed out. Tell me what 